parents of Leo children, welcome to 2020. Yay, happy new year. It's parental guidance. Um, if you'd like to schedule a reading for yourself or your child, it's $35 for 45 minutes. Click the link below. Um, also, help us reach 109 subscribers uh, to unlock uh, your child's uh, yearly forecast annual um, review for 2020. I am just believing for good things. 2020 is obviously a once <laughs> in a lifetime year, and I feel that it is very connected to vision and um, you know, focus, laser focus, and accomplishing a lot, really fine tuning your goals as an adult, um, and especially setting an example, a sound example for your child. So um, I know Libra is a, a sign of balance um, and just weighing the pros and cons of both. And I'm just, you know, I really believe that this year is going to be, it's just gonna increase their, their vision, their, their perspective of seeing things. Um, but nevertheless, let's get into your child's reading for January. Uh huh. Hmm. Yep, that makes sense. It's a very comfortable, good, flowing, forward moving month. Yep, not bad at all. Um, you, on the other hand, I see a struggle. I see a disappointment, like this can't be happening. I don't believe this is real. An up, a slight, small upset. It's not major. Um, turn and flow or direction. Like you're gonna have to go another way. Like what you plan, plan things don't go as planned. Um, an upset. But it's, it's like, oh, man, like you planned on things working out one way, but it's not, and you're just going to have to go another direction. But it's nothing that is major that I'm feeling or sensing. Um, so your child, your Leo has the turquoise uh, card in reverse. It says, awaken your empathy. So it's, this is almost encouragement, like, Continue to awaken your energy. In the reverse, I think your child is like giving zero fucks, you know. Um, for lack of a better word, um, I, I, I really sense, I don't know what it is about January thus far. It, it's it's proven to, proving to be a month of isolation or putting the self first. And not in an arrogant way, but just taking the boundaries that we... Um, the lessons that we learned from 2019 and applying them for our benefit in 2020. So um, I really just feel like your child is, um, it's, it's not that they're being, it's not that they're not being empathetic. They're just knowing where to put their energy, where to invest their energy. And they are not helping people who are not helping themselves. <laughs> That's first and, and foremost. The situation is um, there is definitely a change in the wind. There is a redirection. Something new is coming in, and they're really flexible with it. So I don't know what this pertains to. Your child thought they were going one way, and whoop, you know, it's like, oh, okay, well, we're doing this now. All right, well, this is even better. I can roll with that. And it's, um, it may, it's not going to phase them. Even... If, they're just doing construction even if it's um unexpected it's not going to upset them um i, f I feel like it's going to be i wish they would stop <laughs> it's sunday anyway um i really just feel like I'm not getting anything like major, 
nothing that is catching them off guard. I definitely see, see a flow here because you can look at, at the top and you see like this flow of leaves. Um, it's not out of order. It's following a pattern, just like the pattern on uh, the zebra. So there's definitely order to it. It's ordained um, and everything is balanced, just like Libra needs it with the north and south. So I know you probably can't see that. Um, I don't know specifically what this is about. It's a positive, unexpected change in direction. I can tell you that. Um, support is coming in, whether they feel overwhelmed by this change. Encouragement is coming in. It, it could be financial support. Any kind of support that they need to bring something into fruition, they are definitely going to receive it in January. So encouragement, that's good. Um, there are no new beginnings. There's nothing new that they need to, you know, switch their vision to or put their eyes on. What they have been working on, that is what they're going to continue to press towards the mark, invest energy. It's almost like a plow, you know, putting the plow in the ground. They're not forging a new path. They're digging deeper so that when it's all finished, they're going to grow something that takes uh, root or, you know, takes root. Um, it says, take this as an opportunity to rise from the ashes, ashes stronger and more determined. Um, and this looks like corn, but it's not some sort of flower. And um, there's no need for new beginnings. There's no need to start something new. I, I see things deepening. I see, uh, I see focus, fine tune focus, um, a sudden change, but it's going to, it's working in their favor and their better, for their betterment, nothing that they're concerned or worried about. Support is there, so they are lifted up, they are encouraged, you know, they're needing, they're, they will be in need of nothing. There's, there's no need for them to worry because they have everything that they need. And they're just continuing on the path that they were originally. Let's see um, what you guys will be dealing with. Yeah. Yeah. Standing for truth. There's definitely an upset. I don't know what this means. I don't know what this is pertaining to. I don't know if this is um, an argument. I don't know if this has to do with legal stuff. Um, but it's definitely, something doesn't go your way, perhaps. Um, I, you need to learn to, like, to fight, learn to pick your battles. Um, and this is a warning card, so you, you, this doesn't have to end this way. You get these messages, like, on average, 15 days before the month starts, so you can adjust it, adjust the outcome that you desire and want. I feel that this, for some of you, this is a divorce, a child custody situation, a legal thing, a battle, a fight with your spouse. And I would behoove you, I would warn you not to pick a fight um, because I'm feeling like it's not going to end well for you because um, it's like you're on your back. It's, it's like, it's an upset. It's, it's, it's something, it's a, it's not the outcome that you desired or hoped for. And it says, you know, I'm standing for truth. I'm committed to standing firm in my beliefs and I will not conform to the norm or to peer pressure. I will never be inconsiderate or disrespectful towards others while you need a strategy. Don't come out and whatever you got to say about this person, don't do it directly. You will, it will not work. And I, I want to say you will fail, but it's like it, that plan will come to naught. So whatever you're thinking about, do not do it directly. It will not work. It says, I will never be inconsiderate or disrespectful towards others while expressing my beliefs. Only I can 
defend who I am. I'm open-minded, sincere, and honest to the sun and back. I will become a role model for others by emanating truth. Don't do it. Uh, it's like, this is ego. You know, you're like, yeah, but I feel in such and such. Check yourself, because this is ego. And you really could avoid a bad situation if you just, A, choose to keep your mouth shut. And this is parent of a Libra child. Um, so you may try to speak on something prematurely, and that's not a good idea. Um, so this is not the time to stand for truth. This, and it's, it's not the time for you to go the path that you initially thought. What you desire is, is right, but you have to go about it in an indirect mode. Plan your strategy. You got to build your chess board you are going to have to take a step back and be strategic about whatever this is. I don't know why I'm saying this. You know, when I speak, I'm not speaking, like I'm not pulling stuff out of my butt. Like I'm getting an unction and I'm simply sharing it. So this applies to somebody. I don't, not, I don't know what this is for, but please do not like go for the gusto with guns blazing thinking that you're going to get your way, you cannot, this is not the month to force your way to do something. Don't. It will not work out. And you, and it will hurt so many people, especially if this is a custody case, including your children. So don't do it this way. I don't know what that is. I don't know who that's for. If you have more questions, uh, book a session with me and let's talk about it. Um, all the more in a video chat. So uh, that is for Libra children. Thank you guys so much for watching. Happy New Year. Keep the peace and we'll talk with you soon. Take care.